here what's going on leos it's your good sis lava the empress and i'm back with some fresh good love energy for my leos giving you guys a reading we're going to get into the tea on what's going on in your love life what's the energy update what is looking like for my son leo so you know me i'm gonna get right into the tea just so you know energy is transferable so you <clears throat> this could resonate more for your person this could be for if a cross watcher is watching for their leo partner whatever the case may be this also is for your this could resonate with leo sun moon rising venus pluto jupiter whatever however that goes neptune <laughs> Um, yes, so let's get into the tea. What's going on, spirit? My Leo is in love. Oh, wow, the high priestess. Hmm, okay, so some of you guys are definitely in tuned with spirit. Okay, we have the two of wands interesting what are you guys waiting on are you waiting on a message from spirit possibly about somebody or a job okay wow and spirit is telling me to put this upright so i'm going to put it up even though I do read reversals. So I feel like maybe you guys are waiting on a commitment. Some of you guys may be engaged, waiting on, waiting to really tie the net and get married. Or some of you are just waiting on spirit or God or Jesus, whoever you believe in, to um, bring you somebody that will offer you stability. If that's not the case, you could be waiting on a Taurus as well. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or, yeah, Virgo. Because there was an ending. You guys may be separated from this person. There was an ending of some sort. Something happened in your energy or in this connection that, you know, shook shit up for you had you change your perspective on things so you're waiting on you're waiting on answers you're waiting and I see communication coming in this may be your person or this may be you take it how it resonates but I see somebody wanting to come in with some communication so communication about whatever's going on will be coming in quickly this is somebody that is taking charge you could be dealing with an air sign aquarius libra gemini because this person right now is focusing on their coins or maybe you are leo hmm let me get some clarity Cause I ain't going lie, y'all got me confused as fuck right now. It's early in the morning and I just don't know what the fuck is going on with my Leos. What's going on with my Leos? You guys are waiting for something. Or your person is waiting for you. The fact that the tower moment is here, I want to know what happened. Why is the tower moment here for second? And yeah, I shuffle a little different because I honestly don't know how to do that fucking, the regular shuffle. I just don't. I, I don't. But this is just as effective. <laughs> I can promise you that. Um, What's going on in this tower? What is the tower moment? What is the tower moment in the areas in your person? Okay. See how cars just fly out? 
this. Ooh, okay, so we have the Page of Wands in reverse and the Justice card. So somebody could have, you could have been dealing with a player-like energy. Or there was an imbalance in the, in the situation. Some of you guys may have lost the passion in this connection or the person lost the passion after a while. I do see it. And for some reason, I'm getting uh, a message. For some of you out there, it's like I'm hearing this was supposed to be a one night stand. And I don't know who that's supposed to resonate for, but this may have been what you or your person is thinking. Like, this wasn't supposed to be this deep. But now here we are. And then there's an imbalance in this. Possibly, Dylan, some of you may have a child with this person. Or this person may have a child or children are involved. Hmm. But if it's not, there was an imbalance in the happiness. There was an imbalance with not enough good times with this person. So that's what probably caused the tower moment. Let's just see. But I also get another message that for some of you guys, whatever was lacking before i do see happy times do coming in as well because after i took the sun out there's the ten of pentacles so there whatever you're waiting for may not be in vain it may not we'll see let's see what would be the overall outcome what is the overall come on what is the overall outcome This connection for my Leos. Okay. And I pre shuffled off that. Okay. 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 Yeah. Um. the crown chakra you guys are blocking your crown chakra by overthinking about this connection my head hurts you guys you're waiting for this person to commit to, to you to come in for some of you out there for some of you are just waiting to find the one when is the right one gonna come feeling like you're working hard but not really seeing any benefits out of it but spirit is saying no worries good time is coming relax your mind meditate we have prosperity begins so some of you guys are too worried about how your um how your stability is going to be because after this tower moment you know it made you feel like what's going to happen next I don't know what is to come for me. So you're in your head about it. Because there is some pain in this, as I said before. You may have experienced some heartbreak in this connection, some pain of some sort, emotional uh, pain. But that was all a part of your transformation, Leo. This is all a part of your transformation. This is spirit saying you are, things have to end in order for there to be new beginnings. A new beginning is at play for you. Some of you are starting to eat healthier, wanting to be healthier, wanting to change your appearance after this tower moment, after this heartbreak, because you're like, uh-uh, no more, never again. That's what I'm getting. And it's caused you to be mentally confused. You're in your head about this a lot. You don't know what to do. Let's let's see. See, I'm tired of I am tired of Fulio. 
whoever this is. Let's see, what's going on with Leo's person, Holy Spirit? What's going on with Leo's person? Kisses, unconditional loving, giving and receiving, affection, falling in love. So that's something that you guys have to look forward to. That's a great um, thing. Yeah. Oh, wow. You guys. So the first card that came out was ascending, transcending obstacles, learning, expansion, new phase, prepare for union. What did I say, you guys? This is basically the same card. You're transforming, your energy is upgrading, you're turning over a new leaf, you're <clears throat> destroying old habits, welcoming the new experiences. You're changing. Things are changing in your life. For some of you out there, you may be meeting your soulmate soon, if you haven't already. If this person is not your soulmate, this person may be your soulmate. There may be a soul connection, a soul contract. But this relationship, this person could have been too codependent, or you could have been too codependent. Like I said, take it how it resonates. There was a blockage in this connection. Somebody could have been suffering from addictions too, as well. Alcohol, etc., shopping, whatever. Being lazy. But someone likes you. Romance is blooming. So if you guys, Leo, if you're waiting for love and you're waiting for that commitment, yo, it's coming in. Once you transform and get out of your head about it, it's coming in. Endings bring new beginnings. You guys, did I not just say this? Growth, change, liberation, transition. So you have ascending, coffin, and then you have transformation, which is also the death card in Tarot. You guys, new beginnings are coming. If you need to hear this, this is confirmation. New beginnings are coming. Your weight is not in vain. Take this time to really focus on yourself, self-worth, time to heal, shadow work, self-appreciation. Because you're going to need to do that in order to receive these blessings that are coming for you. Because this soulmate that's coming in, ooh, they're going to give you love that you've never felt before. And you got to be ready to accept something like that. You can't be... Coming into that with trust issues, abandonment issues, codependency issues. This is a time, take this time to heal on your inner child and not focus on when your commitment is coming in. Focus on making yourself and turning yourself into the soulmate that you want to attract. That's a gem. Y'all gotta, gotta take that advice. Let's see. Let's get some further advice. Let's get some further advice for my Leos. Because I feel this new energy, this fresh energy for my Leos. And like I tell all my groups, I'm sorry if my cards come out um, a little messy for, the, for those who care. But I truly don't care. I'm not here to be perfect patty for you. I'm here to just give you clarity and guidance, you know? But, yeah, I don't have time to do all this. <laughs> I really don't. I try to make it a little nice for you guys before I fall out. It is what it is. Y'all got the message. Okay, let's get right into it. Let's get right into it.
What advice do you have for my Leos regarding, you know, this situation? What further advice do you have for my Leos? What further advice? Oh. That's a lot of cards. Okay. Oh, nah, this is too much. Let's read what you have so far. At the bottom of the deck, we have Belonging, House of Night. So this is Spirit saying, if you ever felt like you, you're not attaching or you don't have anybody in your circle that make you feel like you belong in this world or you belong to a group or people, if people ever make you feel like um, you're not wanted or you're not loved, Listen, you are, and you do belong, and right now, you're in this uncomfortable situation for a reason, because you're transforming. It's like when a caterpillar turns into a butterfly. I'm sure when they're in the cocoon, they would love to see the sunlight, they would love to see what's fresh and new, but right now, that's not the time. Right now, they have to focus on changing within themselves. To turn into something more beautiful so that they, they can fly and take risk and be free. Spirit wants you to be free. Have obedience when it comes to your self-love. Don't be like, oh, I'm going to the gym and then your ass sitting on the couch still eating Dunkin' Donuts. Watching you on Netflix. Have obedience when it comes to yourself. Know that you're not invisible. You are noticed. People do see you. They do watch you. Okay? Spirits see you. you. You're not going unnoticed. You do belong here. But there's a time for you. Look, self-worth, self-indulgence. This is an important message for my Leos. It's time to heal, it's time to really put this energy that you give to other people into yourself. Really focus on yourself because you're worth it. Spirit is saying, go with the flow. Some of you could have been dealing with the water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, heavy Scorpio, Virgo energy, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, and a Taurus. Yeah, Spirit is saying go with the flow. Right now, it's not meant for you to understand what's going on. They know that things are complicated. It's not meant for you to understand what's going on. It's meant for you to just go with the flow and focus on yourself. So that when this new love come in, you'll be able to jump and accept that with all of you. Knowing that if anything was to happen in spite of, you will always be okay. That's what I get. That's what messages I get from my videos. Let's get one more advice card, and then I'm gonna let you go. So what's one more advice card? I'm not gonna lie, this is kinda giving me a little OCD, but it's all right, because at the end of the day, I don't care. So, <laughs> what's going on? What's the advice for my Leos? You guys are really changing. You gotta accept this change. You gotta let endings end. Let it go for right now, Leo. You're changing. That's what it is. Yo, I cannot make this up, Leo. You guys, I can't make it up. We have deep replenishment, retreat, rest, be held. Right now is the time to relax. Let the answers come to you when they come to you. Replenish your soul. Do things that you like. Do things that you love. We have... 
warrior woman have you answered your deepest calling y'all out here waiting for this connection waiting for this commitment waiting for this conversation or whatever the you're waiting for to happen you're waiting for a sign to happen but you need to focus on what are you doing here what is your purpose why are you here what are you meant to do what are you meant to achieve what kind of legacy are you trying to leave in your name on this earth in the 3d that's what y'all need to focus on forget folio share your voice come out of the cave persecution expression you guys if this is you and this is for my cross watchers if this is your leo that is um doing whatever they want to do or whatever and you're waiting for communication from the leo spirit is trying to tell them to communicate with you guys spirit is working on like they're thinking about it they're definitely thinking about it they want to come in and it may come in definitely because they do love you this is a soulmate connection but if that's not the case and this is for my leos watching some of you may have some passions like some abilities like singing and, and, and creating writing drawing whatever it is that you're passionate about do it also say what you gotta say say the truth tell the truth tell how you feel don't hold back it's no reason to it's no reason to hold back there's a whole world out there somebody gonna feel it you guys transformation this came out <laughs> what is going on you guys are really changing this is really a new beginning on its way for you guys things are changing at a cellular level deep healing you guys are going to go through this deep healing phase you guys are really healing the past traumas 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 that you've had i'm so proud of you guys because you're figuring out what's not in, aligned with your life with your purpose you're figuring out what what needs to change which is amazing so that's the messages i got for my leos if this record if this represented i don't know why i can't talk on this um see i'm having a hard time communicating that's because of you guys i'm gonna blame y'all or your cross watcher i'm gonna blame you or your person but if you if this reading resonates Please leave a comment in the comment section below. Um, let me know the tea because I'm nosy like that. You already know the vibes, period, poo. Um, like, subscribe. Help me grow my channel because I'm worth it, you guys. And I'll leave um, my email, like I said, in the bio. Donations are accepted, but I'm not going to press you on it. But if you would like to help me... Uh, advance my channel for you guys decks or crystals or money whatever it is anything is accepted love you guys daily bye see you in my next video leos